According to the appointment schedule, Klaus Strandberg has booked a massage to relieve his back pains. No doubt all that time in prison has caused muscle stiffness. The masseur, who works at a local clinic, has apparently already checked into the building. Massage expert, Connie Engstrom. It is not fair. It is. It isn't. You can't keep me in here under these circumstances. If I had known... Well, that's easy for you to say. You're not the one supposed to be doing deep tissue massage in a... Oh, come on! Yeah, Donald, I can't... No, I can't hear a word you're saying. Someone turn the TV on. I... No, hold on, I'm heading outside. Do Donald? Do Donald? Donald? Good day, officer. I'm sure I can manage. Thank you very much. So, what's next here? What is this? A large hadron collider? What is this? It's a frickin' chair. Calling from the consulate in Marrakesh. You people uh, no sold us the Nazi uh, chair. What kind of a name is that? Right. So, Johan, this is the biggest day of your life. Please, or not? I cannot single-handedly create an international. There's supposed to be some sort of wheel that. It's not a wheel. It's a graphical representation of a user tightening a flat-headed 5mm screw in a counterclockwise motion. <laughs> I, I gotta tell you, from where I'm standing, it looks a lot like a wheel. Okay, fine. And what are those four semicolon-like little metal things? Donald, things... I'm what? Number four in? How did that... I've been here the whole... Massage expert Connie Engstrom report at the reception desk. That was Connie Engstrom. Please go to the reception desk.
what I'm looking for. We'll play the waiting game. I'm good at that. I meditate. I could do this all day. Johnny Engstrom, monsieur, here for an appointment with Klaus Strandberg. Ah, oh, Mr. Engstrom. Please proceed to the massage room. It's upstairs on the right. I'll inform Mr. Strandberg. Klaus Strandberg, go to the massage room. Your session awaits. I repeat, Klaus Strandberg, please go to the massage room. to search you. Wealthy, of course. With whom he had a daughter, Eva. Wait, Some people get off on this. Not me, no obviously. He filed for divorce shortly after the birth of our daughter. That's fine. And Have a nice day, sir. Later died from cancer. Strandberg saw fit to con his estranged teenager out of the Ah, so the man with the golden touch. Uh, let's get started. Shall we? Ah, oh, this muscle tension is killing me. Why don't you lie down, Mr. Strandberg? Oh, please. Call me Klaus. Hey, you shaved your head, Connie? Nice. Well done, 47. I will leave Strandberg in your capable hands. That's the ticket. I tell you, nothing makes you tense like thousands of people wanting to kill you. <laughs> Both targets down. Now head towards an exit. Oh, hey, you're that masseur, right? Say what? You must be in a hurry.
Welcome, sir. Salutation, sir. Compromised, but I... I don't understand. There is no sign of forced entry, no alarms, nothing. One of my people has gone missing in Johannesburg. A key bearer. I wish I'd been informed. Still, the system demands two keys, and the rest are all accounted for. Except for your late predecessors. Comp? But... His plane went down over the Pacific. It was an accident. Such was the conclusion at the time. Yes. Die, Mr. Fannin. Happens all the time, even to us. It seems like a conspiracy. It probably isn't. And yet, the failed coup in Morocco, the ether virus. Someone knows about us. There is a pattern, and I failed to see it. Providence is under attack. How much was there? Money. <laughs> Not money, Mr. Fennin. Information on all of our assets and operatives. Like you. Take a trench, Director. And make it a deep one. Because none of you are safe anymore. <laughs> 